Hey Vusune, welcome back for another video on this channel. Currently I am back in Cyprus after like half a year or so. I just realized I kind of came back to the spot. It's like one of my favorite spots. It's a little bit messy here, but someone put these chairs. I come here almost every morning after, after waking up. I had a weird feeling today. I just... Um, kind of felt like a like a trader for the for the first time in my life and um, I, I I wanted to talk about it and I don't know if you if the wind is too strong but I just uh, talk what's what's in my mind and um, actually I'm now in the trading industry for like eight years or so or even more I don't I don't even know uh, like end of 16 I started to like produce content and stuff and I, I in the whole time I never really said I'm a I'm a trader. I mean, I, I some, somehow was a trader. I was trading live accounts pretty much from the beginning. So that's, I guess, more than than most traders do that uh, that produce content on YouTube. But uh, I always traded small accounts. I was focusing on like programming and stuff. I also was more into the like the journey, the challenge of finding good uh, and and consistent trading strategies. And I was never really confident in in like trading a lot of money with trading strategies because I think it took a lot of time for me to like get used to it and um, really gain the trust but uh, I, I feel like somehow it's, it's shifting now a little bit um, if you follow the channel you see like the live trading account that I trade for like over a year now which is up 40,000 euro then I have a couple of FTMO projects and also these FTMO projects I will upload more um, videos about this in the in the near future. They are performing so well. Like if I like if the markets don't mess up completely or, or my strategies or whatever, until the end of the month, I'm also big in profit with FTMO. Then after like <laughs> over one year that I that I document these FTMO projects also also on the channel. So it all kind of comes together, and I'm I'm asking myself if this feeling or this like all of this is just a, a hype feeling that I have now because of the I guess I mean it's pretty obvious that the market period, the period is kind of perfect for my strategies I guess so it's not I did not change the strategies at all like in the last year but but the last few months have just shown me that it's working very great like we had this little little Trump tariff crisis and the the, the strategies did not really struggle at all like there was a drawdown of course and, and not a small one but not as big as in the like indices for example and that's always um, my, my benchmark kind of so I got out of this got out of this like all of this like so well and I never expected this and and it kind of like gave me so much confidence in the in the last few confidence in the last few months and also this month like as I said, if the FTMO accounts do not mess up, I, I will make at least uh, 5k in profit in my trading account. So that's basically a a level of profit where I would say I could theoretically live off of this. It's not a fancy trader lifestyle and stuff, but I could live off it. And even though I know it is not like consistent, it, it will never be like 5k every month now. I, I see the trend is... It's very good actually and also I feel like um, that's what I said in previous videos already like I want to go more into trading now and want to focus more on it maybe also go more with like FTMO try more like to flip challenges and stuff and then trade the accounts because I see right now like what I learned in the last year I, I could really make money with it and this is a Bit weird for me. Also, uh, you probably saw my my content shifted a bit, and uh, I'm doing less like programming tutorials and stuff. And I don't know if it's a good thing, but but right now I feel like kind of focus more on the trading part of everything. And I mean, I'm pretty sure I will make more programming tutorials again in the future. And I know that many people like to see them. But on the other hand, I always feel like I did so many programming tutorials already, and I kind of covered everything. So if you really want, you can like learn everything already on the channel and this is somehow like not the big challenge for me anymore it's not so interesting for me uh, anymore to like do the same stuff that I did uh, the last year and just repeat myself and for me right now the challenge is more to um, get more into this trading and really try to make a 
decent amount with trading and it's also working working very fine and um yeah so that's basically what's um what's keeping me active in the last few weeks or months <laughs> and it's a it's a nice um i i kind of enjoy the process it's very cool to see all of this and um yeah to document it um there will be more videos on this like ftmo stuff uh, and the hopefully payouts that i get this month also i'm i'm i should be qualified for also a scale up in one of the 100k accounts that i have which is super exciting for me never had this before and i'm, I'm curious how this will be so um yeah i don't know it, maybe it's just the the hype and the like the market period is so good for all of my strategies in the last days pretty much every account was making money every single day and maybe that's where the feeling's coming from but yeah for the first time i feel a little bit like a like a trader 